Hi there, I'm Andy Hillier, and today I'm going to teach you how to play the main theme from Squid Game. Uh, it's called Way Back Then. Uh, I've done a cover version of it, so if you want to see me play it all the way through, check that out. I'll leave a link in the description. Just before I teach you it though today, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, which is Andy Hillier, give me a like on the video, the thumbs up, and leave me some comments in the comment section. Let me know what you thought of the video, let me know where in the world you're from, and what song I should do next. And if you love what I'm doing and you want to support me, keep me doing this channel and doing these videos, uh, and you want to print the tabs off for this, I'll put them on my Patreon page. I'll leave a link to that in the description. My guitar is in standard tuning. Now the song starts with some drums, just go like this. So it goes coffee, tea, coffee, tea, coffee, 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 tea. And it does that twice. Um, so that's the first line, just some uh, hitting of the um, guitar. Okay, uh, on to the next line. This is like the main theme. It goes. So all played on the E string nearest to the floor. And it's going to go seven, seven, seven. Um, instead of saying seven, I'm going to say sev. So it goes sev, 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 sev. And then it goes up to 11. And then back to seven twice. And then E5, E3, E5, E7. So bar six goes 11, sev, sev, five, three, five, sev. Uh, so bars five and six, you've got. Or even slower. Bar seven is the same as bar five, so just seven going. Da, 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 da. And then bar eight goes seven, five, Three, five, three, oh, oh. So seven, five, three, five, three, oh, oh. So the whole line. So that line repeats, so you play it twice. The next line starts with the drums going. And then we get like this little bass line that goes. So just A7, D5, A7, D5, on to bar 12. A7, D5, A7, and then A5, so bars 11 and 12. And then on to the next line, um, which I've put together both the melody line and the bass part. Um, you could just play the melody over the top of this, um, or you could just play the bass part, or you can try and put both together like this. So for that, A7 and E7 at the same time, then an E7, E7 with D5, then back to A7 and E7, E7, and then D5 and E7, so it goes. And it goes up to 11 on the E string, 7 on the A string. E7, E7 with D5, E5, then A7 with B8, E5, E7 with A at the same time, so bar 14. Bar 15 is the same as bar 13. And then bar 16. Which is A7 and E7, 
E5, A5 with B8, E5, then A7 with B8, E5, oh sorry, B5, and then another B5 with E7. So bar 16. So the whole line slowly goes. Next line is just playing B5 and B7, just going. Um, just watch out for the last one on there, it's just playing a B, two B5s in a row. And then it, that slides up to fret 12 and onto the next line. E, B and the G strings at the 12th fret, and you're gonna play the low E string at the same time like this. And then another low E, and then another B5 sliding up to the 12 and doing the same idea with the open E. And then we get a little run that goes. Uh, which is playing E, B3, B, G2, G, and D4. So that line goes like this. Two, three, four. Four, two, three, four, one. And that takes us to the next section that goes. So for that, bar 25, we've got both of the E strings, then another E, E2, E3 on the top and the bottom strings, then E2, E3, so bar 25, into the next bar, we've got D string with E5, hammer on from E3 to E5, pull off back to E3, and then E2, E, and then the low E3 with B3. So bar 26, then bar 27 goes A string with E5, then another E5 on its own, E3, E2 with an A string, then open E with an A string, then E2 with an A2, uh, so bar 27 goes, then it goes to E3 with an A3, then E2, E3, E5, E7 with a low E7. So the first four bars of that line go. And then that repeats, um, and then on the second time you're just holding it down and then you just play the E7 um, five times just playing that E7. And then the next line is just the melody uh, that goes again. So we've played that already. The next line I've just done it in fourths. So it's playing exactly the same thing, but playing it on the E and the B strings. The only one to watch out for is when it goes to 11. I've got 11 and 12 on the B string. Every other note is just on the same fret. So hopefully that makes sense. And then the last line, just percussive again, doing the drum part, uh, and that's the whole song. Well, I do hope you've enjoyed that little guitar lesson. If you have, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, it really does help the channel out, it helps me out. Give me a like on the video, that helps it. Um, and leave me some comments in the comment section. Let me know where in the world you're from, let me know what you thought of the video, 
what song I should do next. Just give me some feedback, would be amazing. Um, and if you love what I'm doing and want to support me, keep me doing the channel, keep me doing these videos, and you want to print the tabs off for this and loads of other songs, um, I've got a Patreon page. I'll leave a link to it in the description down below. Thanks for watching this. I've been Andy Hillier, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.